As we move closer to high school graduations, it's great to hear about all of the hopes, all of the dreams, and the many aspirations of all the young people moving forward, especially when they have goals that are just quite frankly sizzling. Our Keith Russell has what one young lady in Cedar Hill is cooking up now for her future. Cedar Hill senior Sydney Stevens has all the ingredients to succeed long term. You have to have the passion. You have to have like some type of self determination drive. Stevens' drive has allowed her to be a cut above the rest. Currently in position to graduate fifth in her class. Anybody can do it. I promise you, anybody can get where I am if they just study hard, work hard, and just stay motivated. Stevens is so motivated she has decided to put all her eggs in one basket. Following her dream of becoming a chef, she's been accepted to the Culinary Institute of America in New York and Johnson and Wales University in Rhode Island, two of the premier cooking schools in the country. She's setting the bar for me personally just to make sure that I make every kid unlock that potential that they have in anything they do. Becoming a positive example for others to follow has not been easy. In 2016, Sydney's journey took a major turn when she lost her father, Walter, to congestive heart failure. In one swoop, she lost her best friend, but gained a desire to carry on his legacy. He was the cook of the house, so like when he passed away, it just took that away. Nobody cooked, nobody did anything, so like I guess I just took the role of it. and. Now he just lives through me, not too much. And no one will ever have to pepper Sydney Stevens to get her to reveal her ultimate dream. My ultimate goal, um, one, make my father proud. And the other is just to own a restaurant down here um, first, see how that goes. And then I expire to have a restaurant on every continent. And just maybe she's already found her first repeat customer. I'm making sure I get some of the ingredients in there. Sydney, this is pretty good. We're good. Thank you. Pretty good. He's quite the critic. So if he says it's good, Sydney, it is good. By the way, Sydney says that she is still in the process of making her college decision. Her choice will be based largely on the financial package that are being offered by the different schools, but money will not stand in the way of her dream. Sydney, we are rooting for you and wishing you all the best. Hey,